G'day, I'm Damien Smith. I uh, run the Master and Apprentice program, um, which is which is a program that we we got going a couple of years ago. We get some young riders um, for the year and uh, give them a bit of a helping hand, help them with uh, some bike setups and some few bits and pieces, try and steer them in the right direction. And uh, I've got Tommy Kite here with me, with uh, and he was the first apprentice back in. Uh, 2011. Yeah, 2011. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we, we he's sort of progressed quite well. He's he's uh, he's gone up to gone up from like uh, 25 to 30th outright, right up to to 15th, and, and some almost top tens. Um, and uh, yeah, so we're going to ask him what he thinks of it and how how it was, and uh, and what's his what's his future plans. Back 2011, out of juniors that um, just kind of got you kind of foot in the door or name out there kind of thing and got to meet a lot of the different um, like industry guys like the magazine guys and the clothing or whatever so that was good and then um, you, don't, you probably didn't realise half the time all the little stuff you're telling me but <laughs> just kind of hanging around him all the little bits and pieces you pick up it's always good so it's just learning off the old guys I guess just passing down the knowledge so yeah it was good and where do you see yourself going? Uh, I know you're doing your builder's apprenticeship at the moment. Um, you're studying at tech and racing, doing the whole thing this year. Uh, where do you see yourself going next year, you reckon? Um, well, next year's probably more full on than this year for like TAFE and all that. But um, I just want to get that out of the way so then I've got like something to fall back onto. Um, and then, yeah, have a real good shot at racing and put like more effort in with the tr on the training side of things and um, yeah kind of get my results a bit more higher up for um, and then, yeah try to get in talks with some of the bigger teams and that and try to get in with them a little bit it just help out a lot like we're doing pretty much everything by ourselves at the moment um, just me and dad he, he, I work for dad so it kind of works in good that way and um, yeah, so it's a fair bit of time. Like by the time you work of a day, then like everything else. So just I can just make it that little bit easier getting in with someone else. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I reckon you're doing great. I'm proud of you. Just like the son I never had. Yeah, you need one. <laughs> uh, thanks. And I'll, can I thank the people that helped sure, me? Out? You can. Um, yeah. Well, I'd like to thank Graham from Honda Genuine Oils. He's kind of we well, mainly talks to Dad. I I kind of stay out of that, but um. I'd like to thank him for helping me out this year and last year. It's been like massive help. And um, Force Accessories, the guys from there, they've been helping me out since I was with you. That's how I got yeah. to know them. Yeah. And um, Pat from CNR. So um, I'd just like to thank all them guys for kind of keep like helping me out throughout the whole thing, not really kind of letting me go. So yeah. but that's been a huge help just them. Yeah, and they've taken half of my product yeah. off me and given it to you, <laughs> which is not that's good. good. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. Yeah. good on you.